When someone has, let's say, low back pain that radiates down the leg, usually that's caused from a compression of the nerve root. Like in, let's say, a spinal cord is like the tree trunk and the branches are the nerve roots in the spine. Those branches or the nerve roots can be compressed by an inflamed disc or herniated discs. And so the whole idea with corticosteroid injections is we're trying to decrease inflammation, to try to decrease the swelling so it's not pinching on the nerve. Um, the injection itself is actually contains a small amount of steroid. Um, the remaining is a little bit of local anesthetic which helps break the pain cycle. And the remaining is actually saline or, or salt water. And basically what that helps is wash away all the inflammatory factors that could be also contributing to it. The, the small amount of steroid helps coat the area of the inflamed area so that can help facilitate in the reduction of that inflammation so that it's not pressing upon that nerve root that's then causing the, the pain going down your leg or what they call radicular pain. Uh, I would also like to uh, correct what a lot of lame people say in terms of I have sciatica pain because sciatic, sciatica pain would mean that there would be compression of the sciatic nerve which is not a nerve root from the spinal cord it's actually a, a nerve that's up here in the thigh area that's actually distal to the nerve root and when we're doing spine injections we're not really treating that, that, that specifically that sciatic nerve we're treating the, the nerve root that's coming off the spinal cord that's being pinched by the inflamed discs.